Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome to the Ultimate RTG. 500,000 coins in the bank. Your eyes are not playing tricks on you. We legitimately have 500,000. We're very close to a mega team. Like Boateng, Alaba, Mkhitaryan, you name it. And we've made some new signings. Now my intention is to switch out to a 4-3-1-2. And the reason for that is I've been playing a lot of pro clubs recently with a 4-1-2-1-2 wide. And I've been defending like four humans running at me. So if I can do it in pro clubs, surely I can do it on ultimate team so if that is the case then that will inject a little bit more creativity in my attack like think about it 4-2-3-1 it is difficult to get going it's a great formation and one of my favorites on the game but if I can add that extra man up top to then play the one two passes and unlock Del Piero I'm sure it's going to click and I'll feel really good because yeah in the 4-2-3-1 I've been so stale and in the last episode I just couldn't get anything going and it wasn't for me to really like take it out on my opponents it was I did that to vent a little bit of frustration because I know myself I wasn't playing very well. So today's episode, we're wanting to turn that around and really get things going. With Pepe, I mean, his price has been up to 15,000, like his overall price cap. We've got 10,000 coins. I sold him as soon as possible. I didn't believe that they were going to actually do that. So 10K is a good price. We've made profit. Vertonghen, 25K. Tiago. Now, I was interested in trying this guy, but with the 4-3-1-2, I don't really think that he's going to be able to offer what I'm needing from my player. Players. I want to find Vidal's, like, um, I guess Baby Blanc, but he's 700,000. I was very close to like selling Vidal and then trying to get Blanc in the team, but I still wouldn't have been able to afford him. So let's slow down a little bit. Like, we've only, well, I say only 500,000 coins is a ton of money, but it is in between. Like, I hate this. You've got like not enough to purchase icons, but then you've got too much to purchase like the average players, if you understand what I mean. But I'm fine with that as long as you actually recommend me some cool cards then fire them my way these came from the same pack like Handanovic, Gomez, Sane and Rudiger like what is that? That pack luck was OP so if you've missed the pack opening well you would have seen it it was uploaded yesterday I'm pretty sure it was yesterday uh, DiMarco sold some informs I decided to get rid of um, Brahimi we bought for 13,000 sold him on for 22 so some of those investments really did come through company 20k and a few of these cards Martial now the thing is we bought him for 68, sold him on for 72. And in the episode, I did tell you that I, I think that it's his work rates. There's something that I didn't click. The connection wasn't there with the card. FIFA 17, he was brilliant. FIFA 18, he's going to score goals. He was doing that in squad battles for me. But I just don't feel like 72,000 invested into one card that I'm not really getting on with is the best of ideas. So unfortunately, it didn't really work out. Maybe later on down the line, we repurchase the card. What I am wanting to do now, though, is unlock in that lone Del Piero. You you guys know that I wanted him on the road to glory. EA have been seriously busy dropping a ton of SBCs on the game. Harry Kane, player of the month. I was hoping that it would have been Aguero, but there you go. Harry Kane always finds a way to win it. Alessandro Del Piero over Mars, and we've got Rui Costa. Now, I was in the middle of unlocking Rui Costa on my main account, and I scrolled down, and it was the best mistake I ever made. Because look at this. 86 rated, 85, 84. That is far too expensive. He costs around 400,000 to 500k, though, if you've already got, like, most of the players, which isn't so bad. 90 rated icon for 500,000 coins. I think that is a good price, but at this stage in FIFA, you're really wanting to free up those coins. You don't want to be locking them in all on one player as you haven't really been given the opportunity to try any others. There might be a cam on the game that plays a lot better than Costa. You just don't know. One thing I am going to do, though, for today's episode is unlock Del Piero. Well, to be fair, I will eventually try Rui Costa, but Del Piero is my man, right? And I need to get my hands on this tradable card, untradable, whatever. Like, if this is someone that I fall in love with and he is perfect for my style and how I want to play, I honestly wouldn't mind giving 500,000 coins to the unlockable um, SBC and having him throughout the whole of the road to glory. If he's going to cost me a million, then that is far too much, you know. But this is what I'm going to be dropping in to this SBC. Uh, Del Piero alone, 83 rated. It doesn't really cost us that much. Most of these players I did in fact pack, unless I purchased Horn for 1,500 coins. So yeah, Otamendi, these guys, 750, 1,400 coins. Now, of course, I could go and sell these cards and maybe get like 15, 20,000, possibly even more. But I want to try by Del Piero man and he fits into our team and he just looks like so nice. Which version do you think is the best? I would say the baby version and that's going to cost me 1,300,000 once we get the coins together. 
oh, I don't know if it's worth doing the tradable, the untradable. We're going to have to find out. So let's unlock him. Welcome to the Road to Glory, the Italian Beast. It's only alone. 20 games, though, is a lot. So that will give us a real feel of how he's going to play for us. Good pace, um, good dribbling, good shooting. I love it. So I did say we made a couple new signings and we haven't really broken the bank. So if they play well today, I could quite easily recommend them to you. I'm sure you've got 30,000 coins together. And if you have, someone like Moussa Dembele, you might want to be bringing into your team. Now, looking at that weak foot, two star. Mm, yeah, it's not good. It, you can't get away from that. Now, I'm hoping that we can really force him down the left-hand side a little bit. So if he does get into a good position to score, we can either finesse it or shoot across goal, you know? Uh, looking at the attributes, 92 strength. That is what I like. And I was looking for someone that is very similar to Atoro Vidal running up and down the pitch. Now, although this guy has medium-medium work rates, he's going to act like that anyway because I, I will take control of him, track him back, and just be a nuisance, you know? The ball control, the dribbling, the composure all look very good and I'm hoping he does play well for us. So 31,000 coins. I sniped him with the engine chem style. I think that's a good purchase. Human Son. We're going to be using him instead of uh, Martial and I've tried him on my main account. I've used him in foot draft and I still really like him. So instead of using Martial as a striker, we're going to be bringing in Son who has the high high work rate that I like. Uh, that's one of the reasons why I got on with Lacazette because they provide a little bit more support in your midfield and then they can push on and overlap. So five star weak fit is dangerous and the four star skill moves. What's his stats actually saying though? Really good acceleration and with the Hawk Chem style, I'm sure that's going to be uh, up to a little bit. Stamina is fine so he will be playing alongside William I don't know how well that's going to play so if I do get on with the 4-3-1-2 and I decide that that is the formation that I want to use going into the weekend league we might even drop William like he might not fit into that cam position for us and we'll look elsewhere Del Piero though He's going to be playing Cam. And looking at these stats, like, that is disgusting. 94 vision, the agility is fine, the reactions, the everything. Literally everything. Even his strength, 64, isn't so bad because he's not that tall. He's only 5'9". So, medium-medium work rates, 5-star weak foot, 4-star skill moves. Now, the medium-medium... I would prefer a high medium on my cam because you know they overlap for me and they get goals. That five star weak foot though is going to be dangerous. I love the look of that card. I have gone and included Leno in the team. Horn didn't really cut it. So you guys were saying, yeah, go and purchase Leno. We packed him. So it all worked out. Now the custom tactics I have changed slightly. And uh, a new thing that I wanted to include was to change from organized to free form with my chance creation. I felt just so stale, really like it just didn't work. So free form i think it's going to add a little bit more creativity and then the pressure of up to 50 uh, up to 60 and i've lowered the aggression to 55 i was playing on 65 so i'm hoping that this does play well and i brought the team with up to 50 so with the custom tactics i've shown you the play instructions i won't really touch too much to be honest i want to see how it plays just really as like basic are we ready i'm not playing the weekly because everyone on twitter has been complaining and i'm not even comfortable with this team yet so i want to be playing a lot of games later tonight and then i will start the weekend league on saturday so let's go find out how this team plays and how alessandro del piero can perform so we are going to be faced up against herrera and that is one player that i was uh, looking to bring in so if he plays well against us maybe we can just take out mkhitaryan and yeah use him right boys here we go let's see if we can start playing really well in this formation oh my god the referee's already got in the way and that's what i'm looking for just literally uh, just to keep passing like one two across the pitch and see if we can work the ball a little bit better. Because, yeah, I have been so stale uh, recently in that 4 2 3 1. It just hasn't worked at all. That's going to come straight over to Dembele. Baye with the shot. Ah, oh, deflected. Go on, Dembele. Yes, Dembele. And that's the pace and that's the strength tracking back. And he's still got that challenge in again. Wow, he's like a rocket man. He's jetting up the pitch. Foot through ball. Give that over to Dembele now. Now he's on the left hand side. That's going to be perfect to get that shot. Whoa! That's good play, though. I think I'm on side. David Alaba, well done. And that's why you have someone that can finish in that fullback position. And I haven't told my fullbacks to stay back while attacking, by the way. They are going to be supporting the play in this narrow formation. I like the feel of it so far. Defensively, I'm actually sound. That's nice passing. Yeah, he's, he's defending me well, though. That's the thing. Got to give him credit. Del P. Del Piero. Oh, he has squeezed that in. A little bit lucky, very fortunate that it did fall back to me, but that is the quality 
from an icon and that's why I want Del P in my team. I'm actually really enjoying the way I'm defending in this formation. It's looking good. In the attack, we need to get those passes going. Lacazette, leave me alone, Lacazette. Yes, go on Vidal, win that. Good one, well played. And then through, down the line, down the line, you've still got, it's still on. Oh, I need to sort out the name bar still. Oh, what well on Del P. Yes, good, good skill, good dribbling. Finesse outside the box. Oh, any other keeper probably would have grabbed that. Maurice, he loves to push him out. Oh, nice son, well done. That was perfect. Del Piero is not missing that. Like, he, this guy can probably bang it from like 60 yards. He's not missing inside the box. I don't know who's on the floor there. Human son is injured. I'm going to try and turn it. Through ball coming. He did not see that. I'm surprised he didn't see that. How many goals have I scored already with Del P? I, I think it's three. I think he's got a hat trick in this first game. Uh -huh. He's trying to take me out. That's close control. Who's that bo bombing through? It is Dembele. Slotted home. And Del Piero, I don't know how he kept the ball like that. Hat trick for Del Piero in his first game. And I do really like the feel of the card. He's perfect. That, that's what you want from a player just to feel responsive, have good passing, good shooting. And that five star weak foot is so important. Would I like a little bit more pace from the card? Of course, but he's still playable. Well, of course he's playable. He's brilliant. Shout out to Dembele. That first game alone, he has proved himself. Two star weak foot though. I was on the attack and I had the chance to shoot it across goal and I decided not to and my play broke up. How often is that going to affect me? Maybe every other game? Every game. I don't know how many times he's going to be able to get into that position where I really can't shift it to the left foot. So that is the only downfall that I've noticed so far with the card. But he is an absolute tank in the midfield. In the attack. Human Sun, is he going to work as a striker alongside Willian? I think it's too early to tell. Willian, I'm not really feeling though in that position. Human Sun is more of a striker. Uh, Miki Tarian sends him in. I, I don't think it's really worth playing him there. Like, he's not getting involved in the play. He's not really doing that much tracking back. I think it's best if we go and purchase Herrera. I'll do it after the second game. I'll go and buy Herrera after the second game. But yeah, let's go to match two. Another player who is using the flat 4-3-3. Rooney, Henderson, and Lalana all across the midfield. With Wille. Wille up top. That's a good play. I can see that opening up. Lovely. Can we get that finish? Well done. Alaba again. He started the scoring off in the last game. And that rocket left foot. Well done, Dembele. Really enjoying Dembele in that midfield position. He is a unit. Oh, it's brilliant. That's it. Good pass. What a ball. What a ball. Del Piero. We need to get this card. We just do. I feel like a rage quit is coming. It is. Are we back to winning ways? And how we usually play in this formation. So this is exactly how I'm setting out the team. We've got the three uh, centre mids across the middle. I'm not using the 4-1-2-1-2. Two, two. It's the 4-3-1-2. And I'm defending well with it. So what I'm trying to do now, guys, is find Ander Herrera's lowest bin. I thought he was about 21k because I sold him on my main account for 20. So if we can pick him up. With an engine chem style. Well, I'm hoping that I can get engine. Yeah, if we can pick him up with an engine chem style for like 20k, then that would be absolutely fantastic. If we can get him for cheaper, obviously, that's fine. All right, so what I'll do is I'll try and snipe one and... I'll see you in a second. So I've just gone and picked up Herrera for 21,000 coins. He basically sells for that, so I didn't really get a snipe. But I was wanting to bring him into the uh, Road to Glory as soon as possible. So someone's played 61 games, have scored 10 goals, and got 14 assists, which doesn't really look that great. But what he has is a four-star weak foot, and I do like the look of him. Will he play a lot better than Mkhitaryan? Let's find out if we notice any changes within the side and how the midfield is playing. 87 stamina, brilliant. Good enough strength, fantastic aggression, and what's his finishing? 71. I'll be able to score goals with that. So yeah, welcome Herrera. That's another signing. It's turning into a Man United team. Oh no, we got rid of Martial. So it's fine. Let's go into game three. I think that formation change has just added so much to the attack. Even the fullbacks are getting involved. We're against Herrera. So yeah, it's a battle of the Spaniards. So let's just play like we were playing before. Nice, quick, smooth, snappy passing. I hope anyway. Oh, I've seen that run. Can we find him? Oh, 
As soon as you lose composure in a formation like this, that's when you're done for. So as long as we can keep our core, cool, Herrera should be a lot stronger there. That's, that's poor. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Alaba, that was well played. That should have probably gone in. Through. Good play. Who's that? Is that a human son? Anyone there? Oh, why wasn't there anyone in the cam position? That would have been absolutely perfect. And that touch was so heavy from son. Back heel. Yes. Finish. Del Piero. Oh, the first shot that he's actually missed. And it still ends up going in. Little icon quality. That was brilliant from William. If we can just turn. Find. Human son. What a finish. That is a striker's finish. He's still very good on the game. What a ball that was. That was absolutely disgusting. My attack has completely changed uh, going to a formation like this. No way would that have worked in a 4 2 3 1. It's just added so much. Well played. This is good stuff, man. I'm really happy with how we're playing. It's awesome. Oh, God. Oh, no. Delpy, what are the chances that he's going to score that? It's 10 out of 10. Yeah, he's gone, man. He's going to rage quit. It's, it's 10 out of 10. This is actually amazing right now. We found a breakthrough. The formation is offering me so much going forward. I cannot describe to you. And in the defense, it's not even that bad. I, I think, honestly, I'm defending better in this formation than I was doing in the 4-2-3-1. The one thing that I want to say is we do have a problem. It's a good one, though. 500,000 coins in the bank. I'm ready to invest all of that into this team. The midfield... I've actually fallen in love with Dembele. He is rock solid. I like what he's about. Even the two-star weak foot, I don't think is going to affect us that much. Like, how often really is he going to get into a position to score for us when I can't shift it to the left foot? Now and again. He, he might, over the course of 40 games in the weekend league, he might actually mess us up like three or four times. I don't think that's game changing personally. Maybe if it's a difficult game, but you know, I don't think it's going to be a problem. And what he's really providing in the midfield, it makes up for it. So I like Vidal, I like uh, Dembele. Not set on Herrera yet. And looking at some of the icons that I've dropped on the bench, I was thinking maybe we could go for like Hernandez, striker, uh, but 800,000 coins is out of our budget. Petit looks uh, very good, by the way. 86 defending and 88 physical. Yeah, uh, pretty much a million coins. So again, he isn't someone that we can look at. Laurent Blanc, I want that card. The dribbling, the pace, the shooting, and with him being right-footed on the right-hand side, it will work so well. And he's not, well, he's expensive. 700,000 coins is ridiculous, but he doesn't even sell for that, uh, judging by, like, the ones that have been listed. So if we can get, like, look, 705, if I add that to the watch list, what's going on here? I, can't, I don't think I can even add that to the watch list. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I can't go up and down because I don't have enough coins to purchase him for. So, yeah, 705,000. I would love to get him for 600. Like, we've got 500k. I don't know if we have a club clear out, we'd be able to get together 200,000 coins, which actually sucks because I would love him for this weekend league. But we can all, always buy him on the next one unless, unless what we do is we sell Mikitarian, Gabriel Jesus. But then if we do sell those, who do we replace? Del Piero with once his contract expires and one of the reasons why I'm playing so well in the 4-3-1-2 is because of that man right there the attack just clicked it gelled everyone knew what they were doing William I don't think is set as a striker I, I, I'm personally again not set on William there but I think he is playable and we'll be able to get away with it let me just take a look at some of the some of the cards that we could get rid of do I have any informs um we could. I could honestly get rid of Bakioko. That's 20,000 coins. Fernandinho, 6k. Like, all of these players will sell. And if we can get together 200,000 coins, I'm thinking about purchasing Laurent Blanc. Look at that. Look at that team if we get if we get Laurent Blanc. Oh, hang on a minute. Yeah. Uh, Bayou won't be on full chemistry. But that's something that I can sort out later on. But anyway, guys, that is where I'm going to end the episode. Please do recommend me any like ideas players what do you think we could do with 500,000 coins like i said at the start of the video we're in between like affording 
we haven't got enough to purchase a, a real icon and we've got too much to bring in like one of those average centimeters I'm looking for a game changer, you know, so anyway drop a like on the video I wish you luck in the weekend league. I'll be starting on Saturday I'm gonna be playing a few more games with this side, but Del Piero look what he finished on like three games five goals one assist Just beautiful water card. Thank you for watching. Take it easy. Team out. Whoosh.